Hey all, Russ here, RVR TV. Welcome. Welcome to the van cave. RV there yet? This is the garage. This is where we're going to be doing the van build. See, I got some lights set up, table saw, all kinds of goodies to go on in the van, all the plumbing stuff. But here we go. We're going to start. Day one, yay. I'm gonna be putting on that uh, soundproofing, insulation soundproofing. All the walls, over the fender wells, ceiling, uh, the back doors, wherever I can get it. I was gonna go underneath the floor. I lifted part of that front and there's no way it would have unleveled that floor really bad, so. But I seen they actually velcroed those wood panels down so they won't squeak. And also I have a piece of uh, insulated uh, carpet. I have a piece of insulated carpet here that goes in it. That's custom cut for the sprinter floor design. I've been battling a cold the last couple days, so I'm not 100%. Pick something up down in Quartzsite. Speaking of Quartzsite, it was a success down there. Seen a lot of people, a lot of vendors were doing very well. And uh, I'd say in 2020 was uh, a success for Quartzsite. I won't be back down there until the end of next week. I'll be down there for the gold show. Yay. Alrighty, well, I got a magnetic camera up there, one on a little tripod. I'll start filming this a little bit, and we're just going to start working away around these walls with this insulation. It's going to take quite a while, so I'll film bits and pieces and put it together for you. But that's the very first. Second, we'll be uh, running some wiring in the walls itself. I'm starting to lay that out. And then the third will be starting to add the insulation. I picked up some beautiful walnut grain paneling for in here too. Alrighty, well, let me get set up and we'll start on the fender wall first, I guess. All right. Slow and go. Looks good. Sticking good. I'm just the uh, little scrap pieces. See the white stuff that was fact put in by the factory. I'll just go around that. Okay, keep going. Well, one fender well done. And I think I'll just. Uh, Keep cutting them. I'll just go around the factory insulation there. But this thing sure rumbles when you drive it, so hopefully it helps. Alrighty. I'm going to run full sheets first, and then when I cut, then I'll just put the pieces down and around the other ones. That way I'm not cutting up full. I have two boxes, but I don't know. Hopefully I have enough. The stuff's pricey. It's like $100 a box for these uh, stick-on panels. A 
Well, <laughs> it's slow. But it'll be worth it. You can tap on the metal and you can already hear the difference. All right, I'm finally getting a little system worked out. Putting the pieces in around there. I think I'll have enough. I'm kind of gauging it. Because I still got the back doors and the slider to do too, but it's sticking good. Just push it on with that roller. All right, gaining on it. Put a little on the doors here. See these panels? Look at this. These just pop right out. I already got this one off. Yay. Here it is here. Turn it around here. See, just some little clips. Pretty nice. They pop right out and you can push them back in. These are staying on. I'm going to keep these on. This will be wood up here. That's go still going to be the plastic panel for this year. But I cannot f put any foam. This is going to have to be soft insulation with that foil stuff. So I'm going to piece all these in. I'll put some soft insulation in there and call that good. That's going to be it for this year. Pretty cool. It's coming along. I'm still in the first box, but I'm wearing it down. Pretty much got the fender well, most of that wall, a little bit of the ceiling. I still have another full box left. So it should be pretty close. Time I do the doors. There'll be a little bit left, but so be it. Should be good. All right. I'm probably going to knock it off today and then start back up uh, tomorrow. Then in the morning we'll go through a little more detail on uh, what's going to go on. Because I'm going to start pulling some wires in here too once I get this foil on here. Soundproofing, whatever you want to call it. But it's looking good, the beast. It's a start, yay. I got Kurt from my wind stuff. He's going to help me cut that window in uh, in a couple weeks. So, but any start's a good start. Long project. This kind of stuff just takes time. But once again, it's uh, soundproofing and insulation. I'm covering the areas at the factory. You can see where they put a little bit in but not near enough. This thing sounds like a tom-tom drum when you go down the road. Ba-boom, ba-boom, ba-boom. So hopefully I'll cut down on some of that. And then uh, there'll be, uh, where I can't get to, there'll be uh, that foam sprayed in the crevices, rigid foam, and then uh, soft insulation too. So there'll be three different types of insulation. I watched a ton of videos on insulation too, and uh, I wasn't very impressed. So, I've done this before. Alrighty. Okay. Um, well, I'll give you one more update before I quit. All right. Be back. <laughs> okay. Here we go. It's it's almost 10:30 uh, at night. I kept going. Took some cold medicine. Got something to eat. Pretty much, it's as far as I'm going to take it for now. Up here, the fantastic fans will get cut in. A little wiring. So I have this much left over. And uh, I'll piece out the rest of it before it's all said and done. Plus, I haven't got the slider done here.
So the slider's done. The window goes here, but it's all in here. I pieced it in. I'll put a little more up here and just run out what I have. But there'll be a fantastic fan here. And one back here. So there's two fans going in here. So I'm really stoked. Happy I stuck with it. It's not hard. It's just very time consuming to do this. But it's done. Yay. All right. All right. I'm done for the night. Talk to you tomorrow. Take care all.